Here's the action of just turning the wood. That's all we're trying to do is we're going to turn, turn that wood to go around. This is like the top edge of the knob. We need, 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 we yeah. One turn to the other is always a very quick turn. If you want that knob to be smaller, that S card is going to be cool and tight. Hi, I'm Conrad Armstrong, member of the steering committee for the 2022 Puzzle Parley. On Friday, there were three two hour puzzle cutting workshops where, at different times, Conrad Armstrong, David Beffa Negrini, Shay Carmichael, Tom Spencer, and Chris Yates, with help from Melinda Chabelle and Lisa Von Haslin, gave hands-on instruction on how to cut a wooden jigsaw puzzle. Each instructor came up with their own syllabus and style, but we talked about things like print sources, glues, plywood, blades, and saws, before letting each student sit down at one of six different scroll saws and try some cutting. Students started by just trying to cut following a wavy line drawn on scrap plywood, then trying to cut a line with knobs. After getting the hang of it, students could choose a postcard sized puzzle blank with a picture already glued to it and cut it into a puzzle. Most ended up cutting their first full puzzle and taking it home. Because the scroll saws were brought by the instructors, students also got to try out different saws. Some students have since purchased their own scroll saws and started cutting puzzles as a hobby.